In Isaiah 50, we're drawn into a deeply moving message about the steadfastness of God when we're facing trials. This chapter reassures us of God's unwavering presence, especially in times when we feel engulfed by darkness. The chapter begins by addressing a feeling that many of us know too well, the feeling of being abandoned. It says in verse two, why was no one there when I came? Why didn't anyone answer me when I called? Is it because I have no power to rescue that I can no longer save? These words confront our doubts and fears head on, reminding us that God's power and willingness to save never fade or weaken. It's a great reminder that even when God seems silent, he is always at work. He is always mighty to save. And then we encounter the Lord's servant, a figure of obedience and trust in suffering. This servant, a prophetic picture of Christ, shows us the path of true submission to God's will. The sovereign Lord has given me his words of wisdom so that I know how to comfort the weary. Morning by morning, he wakens me and opens my understanding to his will. In these words, we find the secret to enduring tough times daily seeking God's voice and aligning our hearts with his purposes. As this chapter wraps up, it presents a choice between two paths, following our own light or walking in the light of God. This is much like the teaching of Jesus in Matthew 7, 13 and 14, where he talks about the narrow gate and the hard road that leads to life. Isaiah 50 is a great reminder that in the face of hardship, despair or confusion, we need to cling to the truth of God's character. He is a God who is near, who speaks, who guides and who saves. Even in our darkest hours, we have a light that never dims, a guide that never loses his way, and a savior that never fails.